Here are all of the reasons why I think Speak Now is coming on March 3rd. First of all, Speak Now Taylor's version is next because of the Bejeweled music video. If you don't know me, let me just tell you that Speak Now is my absolute favorite. I am so excited for Speak Now Taylor's version. I simply cannot wait. And I will do anything to bring up Speak Now. Anything. So I am very excited to share with you why I think it's coming on March 3rd. So in the Bejeweled music video, there are tons of Speak Now Easter eggs, hinting that it will be the next album. The biggest one is that she goes into the elevator and all of the buttons for the floors are the colors of her albums. The third one, Speak Now, is purple. After Midnight, which is blue and it's floor 12, 13 is purple. The first floor that she goes to is floor three. So, so many threes, right? Well, Taylor is 33 this year. It would be great for her third album, Speak Now, to come out as her third re-record. I don't know if this is a coincidence or planned, but Lavender Haze was the third Midnight music video to be released. And that entire music video is purple. But the biggest one for me that I posted about a while ago is in the Bejeweled music video. She's holding that like pocket watch and it's counting down and it says exile ends at three, two, one. And that's when she goes into the elevator. But you never see the one. We just, you know, we know that it's a countdown for her exile to end and she's gonna go and be bejeweled now. But what if it means two things? What if it means just a little more than that and her exile, Speak Now's exile, quite literally ends on 3-2, which is March 2nd. And then we get Speak Now Taylor's version on 3-3, March 3rd. March 3rd is in fact a Friday. Recently, Taylor Nation has been posting a lot to do with threes and purple now again. Lavender Haze just came out. It was the third music video for Midnight's. And it's, it's purple, so it makes sense. But again, I will do anything to bring up Speak Now anything. And March 3rd, the date is 3-3-2023. And if you add that up, what do you get? 13. You get 13. Oh my God, the math. Then if we go back to this Spotify commercial from 2020, it says it still feels like March, right over March 3rd. And in one of her recent interviews, she said, can I hint at something three years in advance? Three years from 2020 is 2023. So what do you think? Are we going back to December on March 3rd? What do you think? Is Speak Now Taylor's version coming on March 3rd? If it doesn't come on March 3rd and July 9th this year is not on a Friday, then we probably won't be getting it until after tour. And it would make sense to let Midnight's have its time because Midnight's barely came out in October. So to have a re-record come out in March, it's like four months. So I feel like it makes sense to not do it, but I'm gonna put on my clown makeup because I really like this idea. And again, Speak Now is my favorite, so. <laughs> what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for visiting my YouTube channel and hanging out with me here. Mwah.